Hey, you're Crane, right? I heard a man talking about you. Don't worry, I'm not going to call you 31. I mean, we're all people here, aren't we? Not just numbers? Yeah, I'm Crane. Who are you? My name is Haluk. Hey, so you've met Spike, haven't you? He's sort of our resident mad scientist. Yeah, I know Spike. Yes, Spike will tell you a lot of things. But there's also some things he won't tell. Like his real name. It's Rudolph. Or that his birthday is coming up soon. He'll be 50. He doesn't look that old, does he? 
Are you saying I should get him some sort of birthday gift? Oh, goodness, no. He hates birthdays. It's just... Spike was renting a room from me when the outbreak happened, so I guess I probably know him better than anyone else in Haran. You know, he used to teach at the University of Southern California. He decided to take a... I, I suppose you could call it a, a sabbatical. There was a sort of an incident with a very attractive young co-ed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Spike walked away from his job and came to Rahm because he had an affair with one of his students? Her parents seemed to believe it was the only way for her to pass his class. Not very bright people, if I had to guess. No, no, no. There was no affair. Only accusation. I don't even think it was the girl's idea. So then, what are you asking me to do for Spike? Well, if you could just... I miss hanging out with him. Tell him I said hi, okay? Okay, I'll, uh, I'll get right on that. Forget about the drops. Talk with rice. You got something for us? Thanks a lot. Every little thing matters. If we had no traps set in the city, traveling would be easier. 